Hey guys, Dennis here, Muddy Water Search and Recovery. We're going to do the case layout for Betty Alexander. Betty is missing from Sullivan, Missouri since April 14th of 2019. She was 69 years of age the time that she went missing. 4 foot 11, 145 pounds, dark brown hair with highlights and blue eyes. Her daughter stopped by Betty's house around 4.30 p.m. on April 14th of 2019. The front door was locked. She unlocked the door and found that Betty wasn't home. She noticed Mills on Wills had delivered Betty's meal and was sitting on the table along with her milk. Her glasses were lying on the recliner and her purse was left inside of a closet with her wallet, medications, and state ID still inside. The daughter quickly located the Sullivan Police Department and the Sullivan Fire Department deployed to help search the neighborhood and search the area. The days and weeks continued to pass with volunteers, search and rescue teams, firefighters, law enforcement, and canine teams continued to search for Betty, and they have not found anything. The fact that her meal had been delivered is sitting on the table along with her milk. That is a pretty obvious sign that she may have stepped out but she didn't plan on being out long um just um and this is all i know what i've read on this case at the moment but to me a couple things stand out obviously there's a chance that she had stepped out the door was locked she went to go to a neighbor's or somebody and she could have gotten she could have fell, got hurt, got lost, not been found. Um, foul play, obviously. Somebody could have taken her. Um, there's several scenarios that could actually be playing out right here. And as we dig more into this and we're able to piece more together, we will keep you updated. If you have any information, please contact the Sullivan Police Department at 573-468-8001 or contact John Mackey. He's the private investigator on this case at 888-511-0498. And I believe that I will try to get in contact with him and discuss this case. And as always, my contact information will be down here in the video description. So with that, let's see what we could do to help bring Betty Alexander home. Till next time, you guys stay safe.